Hello, Big Boy Mouse Max for here, and today we're playing some more Metroid Fusion. Yeah. The last time we left off in Sector 4 here, uh, after we defeated Ceres. So, yeah. I guess. Here. And I think I know where I have to go, but I'm not too sure exactly. Oh, no, no, no! That was very stupid. What I just did. I'm charging this so I can kill someone really quickly. Like that, right? Anyway, I believe I have to go to the section I remember where you need the speed booster. Thankfully, I already have the speed booster. Oh, I thought I was gonna, just about to charge. Right there. Oh, nope. Too good to be true. I have no idea how I just did that. Oh, yeah. Then we. Oh my god, that was a bad idea. You know, I haven't been hit. This is where you need the speed booster to go through that room. Right there. So now you can lower the water. And now we can reach new places. Which is what we need to do. I'll just kind of wait for that to go down. Oh, okay, I have spring balls. Oh, and this game is called Jump Ball, but... Yeah, of course. It's pretty damn cool. So now that we're done with that room, I think we can go down here, finally. Yeah, it's no electricity. Okay, red door. Now if you look there, that's a level 4 lock. Wonder why it's level 4. It means it must be very, very important. Very, very important stuff no one can touch, apparently. You're not allowed in there at all. Okay, we can't go here. Oh, we can. Okay. Hey, I think I know what I'm going to do to get in there. That stupid electricity. Yay, look! Missiles. Yes, I'm pretty sure we do still need speed booster right here though. So run and charge right here. Yeah, I so we did need it. Ah, so there is a secret passage down here. I knew there had to be some way to get an item here that says, oh, pardon. Oh well, that's too bad. Guess I can't get that right now then. Wait a second, I'm having a problem. Okay, I'm back. It's just that my internet connection wasn't working and it can't seem to find my internet. So I guess I'll fix that after the video, so don't need to worry about it right now. Where is this? Oh, we need to go from the other side. I remember. There's another level 4 lock that I saw on the map. Very interesting how you can just fly. I'm going to see this trick I've never known about. Ever. Anyway, let's go see what my computer says. And what's my next objective? So Ceres has been affected by the X2. Well as a result you recovered another ability. And that's right, you may even you may be able to face the SAX. Not that it's but that's still a ways off. 
get you guys more support data. This time it's missing up pretty data. You desperately need this, but the data room here is still the level 4 lock, the highest security level. Let's avoid opening sensitive areas unless it's necessary. Also, the route to the data room in sector 2 is blocked. Blocked, still more SAX activity, and a deliberate activity pattern as if it is blocking your recovery intentionally. So, unless it looks like your best option for the sound is in sector 3, you'll find the PYR, Pi, or probably Pyro, that means data room on your map after using a navigation room there. Is your objective clear? Now head for sector 3. Okie dokie. Oxy dokes. Well, if that's where I gotta go, then that's where I gotta go. Ah, oh, my internet's back, that's good. Still can't go to sector 6 yet. Now oh, we can finally add sector 3. I wish that you went in order of sectors because it's strange. You go 1, 2, which is fine. Then you go 4, then 3, and I think then it's 6 and 5. I'm not sure then. exactly. Anyway, what you got to say now? The data room's all the way over there. <sighs> Thankfully, the eggs have not invaded this area yet. The data room here is sealed by another security hatch. In order to download, you must find the security room here and activate level 2 hatches. This may allow the SAO to express that you're today, but we are left with no choice. So recovery is our main goal. The data room is here, as I explained. Security rooms can't be shown on the map. Be careful, so I must you will see very violent organisms here. And avoid the ultra heated areas. You still can't take such high temperatures yet, but we're working on it. Level 2 hatches are green. Release the lock and proceed oops. Proceed to the data room for download. Super missiles. Super missile data is ready. Your firepower will be upgraded or something, I'm not sure. First, activate green hatches to go to data room. There are no ultra heated areas on this route, so turn back if you enter one. Okay then. I I'm gonna call you Sam. Okay, Sam. Is that okay with you if I call you Sam? Alright, I'm gonna call him Sam from now on. Not that I actually needed that, but whatever. Anyway, we're in the red sector. Yay. I do know where the lock in this area is, I, I remember. I think I'm shooting from down there, but I think. No, 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 this is definitely not where we gotta go. Um, I think it was here. Uh, it may seem like it's just an empty room, but I can assure you it's not. Because I'll prove it to you right right now. Now I'll make a run for it. There you go. Oh, I don't know that was there. Ah, and I can see there was an item. No. Okay. I thought I was gonna be able to reach that. Now I'm pretty sure there was something over here. Like, you, you need to jump here, I think. And you need to get over the top and security rooms in there. There you go, yeah. I know I remembered something. And then you go down here and you got a security room. I still remember that. I don't remember what the level 3 or 4 is. Anyway, we can now open green doors, which when I first played. Oh no, they invaded the place. Great. Wonderful. They're here. Oh, I know why they got in here. I freaking opened their way, they don't know. I deliberately opened the level 2 hatches. And that let them in, did not it? Well, that wasn't the smartest thing to do, was it now, Samus? Or Sam? I don't know why, I just realised I called it a shorter version of Samus's name. I actually did not do that intentionally. In case you're wondering. Wait, there's this 
interesting thing about um, a missile tag in this um, sector and basically you can do a 1% run of this game which is you collect nothing at all except for one missile tank because the myth thing is the missile tank is impossible to avoid and people have began I've called the missile tank Bob because of that because he's like the only one there you go that's how you get over I don't know exactly how to get through and I'm pretty sure you can shoot through the floor here so I can kind of see yeah um the only way to avoid it is by using a Taz he makes I'm not sure if you just saw that room I went in when the, there was this enemy blocking my way. You need to either use uh, super missiles on that or shine spark. The thing is, uh, you, you need basically task support to do a shine spark then because it's so difficult to get up there with a shine spark. How on earth do I... Oh, there you go, that's how. Run for it. Yay, I made it. So that was just something about the sector. I'll tell you, just wanted to tell you about that. Oh, the sector has already blown that up. I think there was something here. I'm not too sure. Yeah, that's the book. That's it. Oh, why did I just do that? Uh, that's the missile tank that you could see right there. That's impossible to avoid. At least I think it is. Well, you can't do it unless you have Taz. Will basically make no mistake, including frames. No frame or mistakes. That's kind of crazy. Yeah, there he is, right there. The bane of zero percent runners' existence. Ah, oh, stop doing that. Now that we're in here, basically, there's no way to avoid them. As you can kind of see that. And yeah, he's very annoying. I could imagine. There are a lot of people. You see, uh, there, you can't destroy that guy. You need to shine spark for him. So the thing is, see, no missiles working. They bounce off him. This is not a superheated room, just in case you think it is. It's just a bit hit, but it's not. It's a bit hot, it's not hit. How long have I been recording? 13 minutes. It's, it's still good. It's still play. I can see there's gonna be something there. Come on, I am. Uh, you can get up there. No! Oh, I guess I can't get up there yet. Anyway, data room, we're gonna get super missiles. The thing is, we've upgraded our missiles instead of getting actual different, I think. Yeah, our missiles are oh, now. See that explosion it gave? Something's happened. Great, something always happens. What's in here? That's a save. And I think there's a recharge room on the right, but I'm not sure exactly. Hey, it is as well. What's here? Oh, my turn. Now I can blow them up. The annoying bugger. What are you doing? Get back here or whatever. But now, I'm pretty sure there was supposed to be a boss fight in that room where I tried to all jump, but I guess not. In a way. Oh, now you go back and there you go. 
Houston. Yeah, we're gonna have another boss fight right here in this room. He falls. I'm not sure where he came from. You wanna go up here? He's a security drone or something like that. And then you need to shoot his head. The top of him. I'm not exactly sure if it's his head or anything, but it's the top of him, so I'm calling it his head. Hey, how did you do that? So the flame doesn't go straight away. Stop hitting me, stupid. Oversized machine. That costs way too much money, probably. Stop throwing bombs! They are very annoying. I don't realize I don't like this boss. Oh my, I hate you. This is why, exactly why I don't like this boss. Right? Thankfully, it doesn't take that many missiles. It's just hard to hit him with one. There you go, from this button. The thing is, he never gets to kill him, unfortunately, right now. He gets to kill him later. He runs away. I feel a little wussy. Look at him, look at him, running away. Oh no 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 no, you're not getting away. But right now my missiles can't hurt him. Get out of here. That nearly crushed me. I don't know what that would have happened. If that freaking crushed me. But now we can go up here. What is here again? I don't want to eat screw it. I think that's screw attack at least. At least I'm glad that boss is down. I just don't like him at all. Anyway, I want to explore this room right here because I, I don't seem, it doesn't seem like I can reach. Is this another screw attack? Oh no, that's a shine spark. Ah! So close. Ah, I can run from here. Stop doing that. I need to do it to the side. Really? What about here? Okay, this area is starting to bug me now. That was an accident. Enough if I do one here. Uh, no, screw you, I'm not doing that. Because I don't feel like it right now. Anyway, where are we right now? Oh, I got it. I'm pretty sure there was something like that. Yeah, is he even telling me right now there's something there? Bomb jump up there then. Oh my! Really? Honestly? You really gonna do that to me? No, it's an energy attack. No, 
now how do I get out of it? Alright, I just built that. back to Sam. Twenty minutes. I'll just let him tell me where to go next. I'll go to that sector and then I'll save and I'll end up there. Let's see what you've got to say, Sam. I see that you encountered a rogue security bot. You may destroy it if you meet it again. Your safety is vital. But as, as to your brief level 2 security locks are released for sectors 5 and 6 are open. That means those sectors have likely been infiltrated by X. They are much harder to stop than we initially suspected. Sector 5 is sub-zero. You're still susceptible to colds from the vaccine side effects, so you'll take damage if you even set foot inside there. We're at sector 5 for now, but in the meantime HQ is working data to adjust your suit for extreme temperatures. Once we have the transmission, you can download it, but the X have destroyed all the data rooms they have used so far. I no longer doubt their capaci capacity for critical for You have to use the data room in the night habitat sector 6. Go to sector 6 and access the navigation room there. Subjective clear, yes it is clear. Tread lightly, Samus, you're the only one who can do this. And the X may, may be much more dangerous than we know. Well, I guess I should be getting to sector 6 then. What is this? A Samus suspect anything? No, I do, I do not think so. Good, monitor her closely. Affirmative, out. Okay, what was that all about? I do not remember that at all in this game. It scared me for a moment. Something strange was going on. But I honestly don't remember that happening in Metroid Fusion. I'm gonna go down the lift, one in Shy Squad. Oh wow. Yeah, go down the lift. Anyway, we in the we're up we are in the night area. They have rooms down there. The various suit data is here from HQ ready to download. Get moving to a data room, but there's a problem. X from the sub zero sector, ARC are in sector six, and they they've been changed by the code. If you absorb one, you will be frozen from within. This seems like a deliberate tactic. Once you download the various suit modification, you'll be out of danger. Just be extremely careful until then. The NOC data room is here at RAM, but avoid the blue X. Use your beam to stun them in order to get by. Is your objective clear? Yes it is. Be careful. They are hunting you actively now, Samus. And this area is very dark. Proceed with extreme caution. Oh, it's very dark, isn't it? So scary. Let me just speed this up. Save. And thank you for watching, people. I will see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!